For more than 50 years, this fish market in Tripoli has echoed with the sounds of the fruits of the sea being bought and sold. Fishermen and buyers competing to get what they think is the best deal for themselves on the day's catch of crab, sardines and shrimp. But a shift in economics means this noble trade is under threat. Pensioner Nasu Anous runs the auction house and he's worried. This is not going to last for a long time anymore. It won't last because the amount of imported fish has exceeded the amount of local fish. There's a fish market for imported fish there and there. Their fish isn't that good quality and is imported, but people go there because it's cheaper. Fishmongers, merchants and restaurant owners have shopped at this venue for years. But those cheaper imports and illegal fishing are combining to put it under pressure despite its popularity with regular customers. In 15 or 20 years, I have been coming from Biblos to Tripoli to buy fresh fish. The auction is full of fresh catch, straight from the sea in the morning. And what is nice is that everyone adds what they are willing to pay as prices, and whoever pays more gets the fish. Demand for cheaper imported fish has been triggered by fears about local catches which are often exposed to untreated domestic and industrial waste. The problem has got worse despite the Lebanese government spending around $1.5 billion on water treatment in the past 20 years. For now, the weighing, sorting, cleaning and scaling will continue at this auction house anchored to the ebb and flow of market forces. John Joe Regan, TRT World.